Good morning, Tammy C. Walker here, owner of Dreams Are a Reality. I hope you have a beautiful morning and a great week. Today I want to talk about the importance of focusing on yourself. Think about your life right now and some of the things that make you unhappy. Is it your own doing? Is it your own life or are you unhappy because someone is not doing what you think they should do i'll describe my life for you i would say overall i'm happy there are some missing pieces but when i get frustrated or upset i can name a couple of things it could be because the students i'm working with their parents are not returning the forms that I need to start my program. And we have to be measured on those forms, these consent forms. And I'm talking to rude parents or disinterested parents. That frustrates me. I guess another thing that irritates me is a client who counsels spur of the moment with no regard for my time as a therapist. Our books are are booked. Um, I tried to get someone to talk to just for myself. As a therapist, we need to talk to other therapists because we take in a lot. And the therapist was two months out, booked out. So that shows you how booked we all are. I do this part-time, but my book is full. So I, I can't do same-day cancellations. Uh, emergencies, you're sick, your baby's sick. Any of that is understandable and no problem, but I'm not talking about stuff like that. That's the stuff that bothers me. Or someone that you care about deeply and they're not communicating with you. How frustrating. But at the end of the day, can I make those parents give me the consent form? Can I make my clients respect my time? I can hit them in a the pocketbook. Can I make that person that I truly love and care about communicate the way I deem effective? We spend so much time trying to control and manipulate others. Not necessarily in a bad way all the time, but we just want things to go the way we want them to go. I know I do. Let me speak for myself. And it leaves me in a world of agitation and frustration. But let me tell you when I have my best days, it's when I get up and do my routine and I get to work and I do my job and I fight through the Chicago traffic, get back to my place in the suburbs here (laughs) and put the key in the lock and come into my place. I may have a couple of clients at night. They roll on. It's it's smooth. I get to turn my TV on and watch the Chicago Bulls. Have a nice dinner. Or talk to a dear friend on the phone later that night. Whatever. That's a nice day for me. Or sometimes I'll get a massage. And I'll get something nice to eat. It all all involves food with me. You you see that? (laughs) Or sometimes just waking up in the morning and cleaning my place and and just doing whatever I want to do. I do karaoke with people all around the world through that app, Smoothie. Check it out if you're a singer. Those are the things that make me happy or a cup of coffee like I'm having now. I guess I'm rambling, but what I'm trying to say is don't let others ruin your day. Don't try to focus so much on controlling and outcome stay in the moment be in the moment control the controllables which are you don't let people steal your joy don't let people rain on your parade keep an umbrella all the time you deserve the best in life and where there are problems there are solutions and i'm learning that this stuff doesn't last forever not even the bad times focus on yourself I'm going to get on out of here and you have yourself a beautiful day.
拜。